Meg's acting career ended as Suits producer Klein shakes hands with creator Aaron to dismiss Meg from the new season. Recently, executive producer Jean Klein, who's not so casually worked on Suits during its entire nine-season run, opened up about the show's renewed popularity and a possible revival, in the midst of it debuting on streaming giants Netflix and Peacock this year. The USA Network show ended its run back in 2019, but it's recently been on the receiving end of a new surge of interest after becoming available to watch on myriad streaming services, including Netflix. And to say that it's been crushing it is a serious understatement. During Gene's interview, he confirmed he's been in contact with the creator of the series, showrunner Aaron Korsh, about the potential for another instalment, and talked about what getting certain cast members on board could look like. The producer suggested it could prove difficult getting everyone back for a reunion, but said that he would be delighted if that happened. He added, the bad news is Meghan Markle almost certainly wouldn't be in it. The series creator Aaron Korsh decided to write her off. Klein was the executive producer. He understands the streaming industry and TV show development. He doesn't mention a supporting actress who was written out of the show as a factor for the viewing boost. Meghan wouldn't be invited back, even in the event of a reboot or spin-off. According to H.G. Tudor, Megan thinks that television acting is more real than live theatre. It's not. They can do multiple takes, select the most flattering, put all the focus on a particular character by the way they frame him or her. This is the world that she wants. That includes a good stylist. Left on her own, Megan still wants to be the star. She wants all of the credit too. So she writes her own words and directs for rehearsed speeches and she dresses herself. The show's creator Aaron previously revealed that he hadn't asked Megan to reprise her role in the finale. The episode was filmed following her apparent retirement from acting amid a relationship with Prince Harry, who she married in 2018. Aaron told Deadline in 2019, In the end, I didn't ask, I just thought, I'm going to respect her new life and not put her in the position of having to ask. He further commented, We decided not to push her in that position, so I didn't bother asking. The executive producer Klein mused in his interview. As you may remember, it was a complicated dance keeping everyone involved, getting all the actors' deals done and keeping them involved through the end of the show. I'd be surprised if we could thread that needle for a reunion, but I'd also be delighted if that happened because when you do a show for that long, everyone becomes such a good friend, he added. With an all-star ensemble cast that included Gabriel Macht, Patrick J. Adams, Rick Hoffman, Sarah Gafferty, Gina Torres, Amanda Shaw, Dooley Hill and Catherine Hagel, something tells us it's the hard work that'd be worth it. Now, we know what you're all thinking, cool, but what about Meghan Markle? Gene Klein also dove into that in his interview after being asked flat out whether it was possible to get the Duchess of Sussex back on the show. His answer? I'd assume that's just not possible. It's pretty unlikely we'll see Meghan reprise her role as Rachel Zane ever again, even if there is a Suits revival. So I guess we'll have to settle for ugly crying at a Netflix series Harry and Meghan. 